often in my work, we find people who are trying to figure out how to navigate some course in their life, professionally, personally, whatever it may be, recovery. The result is that they start running into difficulties. And what I often use to talk them through their difficulties is the notion of the flow or the Tao, as some Eastern folks might think of it. And it's this idea that there's a current always flowing through life in all kinds of ways, whether as gravity or you know, the forces that govern day and night. And that our purpose, if you can imagine this analogy, it's like we have a kayak and we're going to work with the flow. Now, sometimes people might decide to go with the flow, literally. Other times they might decide that it's in their best interest to cut across the flow and into an eddy. Another time they may decide that they're going to take the flow into a bunch of white water because they're going to play on the white water. They might even decide that they're going to cut against the current because they want to do that for some reason. There's not a right answer. This idea of go with the flow is an oversimplification. What is not an oversimplification is understanding that things happen in our lives in the world. There are powers and forces at work, things like pandemics, for example, that we don't have much control over. So the question becomes, how do we take our little kayak, metaphorically, put it in or around that flow, and then what do we choose to do with the energy of the flow and the energy we bring to it? The answer is whatever you want it to be, but you can't do it without giving thought to the flow and how you're going to interact with the flow. The results are up to you.